went through all the videos from speed i didn't read from anywhere other than speed i had only uh, little uh, time so i had to like focus so i focused only on speed and all the lectures i went through in uh, one month and then uh, i gave all the grand test so grand test was uh, really helpful i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute uh, to dr shalini permal for scoring a topmost rank of aml 8 Uh, in speciality super speciality of dm pulmonary critical care and sleep medicine in any ss session number 2025 congratulations to you thank you so much sir great now can you know a brief background history about you where you started till date what all you have done yes sir so actually i started my uh, uh, ug i studied my ug from uh, psc institute of medical science and research uh, coimbatore sir and after that uh, i chose uh, md pulmonary medicine and uh, i uh, i did it from andhra medical college visakhapatnam so right. after that i just finished in uh, may 2025 and uh, so now i just gave i nice so great great wonderful and uh, can you tell us why pulmonology and why dm pulmonary medicine critical care is your specialty of your choice so sir, frankly speaking uh, initially i was not into pulmonary medicine i was into medicine since i got uh, md palmo but after i got into md palmo i i grew passionate about pulmonary medicine so uh, even now after uh, uh, md pulmonary medicine i feel like uh, since i'm passionate about it i want to expand my knowledge so that's why i want to do again uh, dm in pulmonary medicine so so that is why great great now can we know what you did to achieve this rank what all preparation how all you did and to get into stock most rank so uh, i was able to prepare only for the last one month actually i didn't know where to start so i actually subscribed to your master class on uh, your mentoring uh, master class okay. and uh, there i got some motivation sir so <laughs> after that after that uh, i looked into all the previous uh, uh, toppers videos and all like how they prepared i i got some knowledge like on how to prepare in a short span of time so first what i did was like uh, i uh, went through all the videos from speed i didn't read from anywhere other than speed i had only uh, little uh, time so i had to like focus so i focused only on speed and all the lectures i went through in uh, one month and then uh, i gave all the grand test so grand test was uh, really helpful and um, mostly i was i, I didn't have uh, time to prepare my own notes so e notes was also very helpful sir so that was uh, a key to my last minute revision all the e notes uh, i was able to go through for the, in the last minute you did perfect so, magic in one month yes sir kind <laughs> of you came and got what you wanted huh? yes sir so actually i uh, gave uh, last uh, in may also i gave iniss and i got qualified i got a uh, 42nd rank but uh, initially i thought i i will not uh, i will not be able to do it uh, get into iniss and uh, institute i will i will not be able to do it but um, after having a taste of that thing uh, i wanted to prepare fruitfully for my <laughs> for this exam so that's why so perfect timing with the right people and yes, the right content works magic actually how yes, and to get on to the what we wanted that's very important yes sir um, congratulations to you for taking thank that. you so much sir <laughs> taking that decision is very important yes sir and if the decision is not done and uh, will not work towards it nothing will happen true sir so we have to have a goal and uh, motivation to go towards it yeah, people have done it so that you can also do it and now seeing you right now i mean uh, in uh, what you have accomplished and more people will be motivated to do that way i'm grateful sir great so can you tell us how many questions did you attend this exam uh, i attempted uh, 79 out of 80 questions sir what was that they are asking actually what was uh, you were missing out last time and what did you prepare uh, that helped you to get on to it so can you talk us something on the paper and also mm -hmm. on the interview sure sir so since i gave last exam and this exam institute it uh, mainly focuses on uh, uh, our dm subject as well as medicine sir so since i am from md pulmonary medicine background i had to work more on the medicine part mm -hmm. so uh, because md pulmonary medicine has fishman and uh, for dm pulmos you have to study fishman so that was like uh, almost covered but uh, medicine i had to uh, go through all the videos and uh, notes for uh, medicine part and uh, so for uh, whomever uh, preparing i would say that uh, to concentrate on your core branch the dm part the pulmonary medicine part more and then uh, have a brush up of the medicine so and uh, to go through all the previous questions so that you will know like where to concentrate in the medicine part uh, 
uh, like which system to concentrate and everything you will get to know from the previous year questions and uh, as far as interviews concerned it was all applied aspects for me sir like how you will manage a case and uh, how will you uh, for for example uh, if a patient is on ventilator if something happens how will you troubleshoot it that was a question for me and um, a few rare questions also they asked like uh, rare diseases and all how will you uh, diagnose and manage so if you uh, if we actually study the pulmonary medicine part then i think interview will crack it sir. so mainly it relies on the uh, written exam uh, like how you prepare and everything based on that itself we can uh, actually crack the interview also great great now, what is the information or the message that you want to share to the juniors who are aspiring for the same speciality? Uh, so, I would say start your preparation early. So, uh, I I was not able to do that, but I would advise to start the preparation early and have have a goal. Like, uh, I was in a dilemma for a long time, whether to take DM or not, because uh, having done uh, MD pulmonary medicine, whether to do DM or not, first have the clarity if you want to do DM. And if you want to do DM, uh, like... Uh, way to do it how would how to do it because neat ss is different inss is different so uh, have clarity from uh, for which exam you're preparing and go through all the uh, previous year question banks and uh, uh, i would say give gts grant test help me a lot you will know the progress how we are uh, whether what you're doing is uh, correct or not whether you're in the right path or not you will uh, get it only through the grant test and uh, so i would say that only so gts and everything great now who introduced speed to you and what was your experience with speed for your preparation can you share something on that sir actually uh, it was my peers uh, so there was like um, i from all my peers they were also preparing for dm pulmonary medicine and we had a discussion like which is better and everything and all and then we came to a conclusion of uh, choosing speed so it was my peers sir Okay, so what was your experience on preparing it? Did you learn? You have already you are an MD pulmonology student. Yes, sir. You know it exactly. It is not that you are new to it. Now, this lectures how it could add value to you to get on to DM pulmonology. It is a lot more different than reading from a book. Uh, for your final exam, you have to read from the book and uh, everything. But for when you are trying to give an entrance exam, you need to know where to focus. So that focus, you will get it only from the... From speed is what I learned, sir. Like you will know, like uh, which parts to focus from the lectures. They will, uh, the, and then it is a, like a consolidation of all the important points and everything. So for the last minute revision, also it will be very useful. So I felt uh, the lectures it had an extra edge because it had all the new updates also because the books will not books will give us a knowledge, but the new updates and everything we uh, I got it from the lectures only, sir. And there was this constant mentoring also. And when I, whenever I had, I had doubts, I can, I could reach out to the faculty and uh, ask also. So that so was five, really helpful. Five sessions are happening throughout. Yes, sir. So time to thank and whom all you want to thank that they helped you from day one till date uh, to achieve what you uh, So first I would uh, like to thank my parents. They were my constant support, especially my father, because he was the one who pushed me to do DM. And then next, my uh, faculties, uh, because uh, they gave me the basic uh, knowledge, like uh, what to do in uh, pulmonary medicine and what is pulmonary medicine. And I, I grew passionate because of my fac faculties. So I would like to thank them. And then my friends and uh, uh, my uh, uh, mentors from Speed also, sir. Saurabh, sir, also. Great, doctor. And thank you for sharing all your experiences. We once again, on behalf of Speed, wish you all the very best and all the success for thank a you, great and wonderful career in DM pulmonology and critical care and sleep medicine. Best wishes to you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.